one, two, three, four, five. All right, we are back once again for some more solo chemist action. So, what did we do last video? I guess pretty much we s helped out Mustadio beat those sandbaggers there. It was an intense sandbagging battle. But we came out victorious. We helped out Agrius. Then most importantly, well not really, we also mastered our chemist job. So we graduated, got our PhD in chemistry. We're super smart now. But just like in real college, we're not going to use a lot of the stuff we actually learned in real life. Because that's how things go. Alright, so let's talk about this next battle. This is Golgorand. And so, Golgorand is... Honestly, I've been a little worried about this, been thinking about it. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to do enough damage against Gafgarian to out-damage Night Sword. And if we can't out-damage Night Sword, then there's not much we can do. I thought that had an attack power of 7. What I read online, that worries me. I was thinking that perhaps we would use a knife, because knife would have more damage. The equation for damage for the knife, I think it was, see if I remember, it was PA plus speed divided by 2, and then all of that multiplied by weapon power. And so, the platina dagger having 5, that'd be 5 plus 8, which is 13, it rounds down, so it'd be 12 divided by 2, which is 6. Wait, 12 divided by 2. Yeah, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, yeah. And then 6, no, no, it's times speed, so, wait, PA, speed, 4, and 8. Yeah, that's only 12. And then that's 6 times 6, that's not even anymore. Crap. Did I do that math right? PA times, PA plus B, that's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 divided by 2, which is 6, times weapon power, which is 5. So that's not even more than a gun. Well, so much than that. Because we're going to have the um, power wrist or the diamond armlet to increase our PA to 5, but if it's going to round down, that's not going to make a difference anyway. Or does the dagger... No. I was going to say, does it give plus 1 speed? It does not, so... That's why I'm a little worried about this battle. And then thinking that we can go and farm some things. Hey, wait. No, no, never mind. But going. No, I didn't want that. To farm. Going to farm the um, twist headband or power sleeve. I might just do all that now. But I was a little worried that we wouldn't be able to do that at Barrius Hill and start as far away as possible. I was going back and watching Arkale's video, and he was farming, or trying to farm, the judo outfit at either Aragoy Woods or Swiggy Woods. But we can't get back to those places right now, because we already were locked off because of this battle. And so we might have to go back and load an old save so that we can go and farm the judo outfit and the power sleeve and the um, twist headband. All those together may help. But if we can do more damage than his Night Sword is doing, then it won't be a problem. We'll be able to auto potion enough that we're not going to die. I'm not worried about dying. That's the only thing that's going to be about this battle. So, we're going to see how much damage we do. He's not going to be able to hit us the first turn, at least. So, we're going to shoot. Wait, well, he gets the first turn now, doesn't he? That's unfortunate. I don't think shooting and waiting in place is going to help. And hopefully the Time Mages and uh, no one else has any way of sandbagging no cure item. Because if that were... He has battle boots, doesn't he? I don't think he moves that far normally. Which, that's not helping me at all. And then I'm not sure if my... Zodiac choice is going to affect this any. Yeah, hammering the battle boot sucks. So, what is it? Virgo. So, that's neutral. It would have been best compat. So, now I'm worried that. No, it would have been worse compat. 
because Pisces are the same sex. And so now I was a little scared of that, that, yeah, we're only doing 36 because we're neutral. So I'm worried that having neutral combat, I'm not going to be able to out damage Night Sword. So worst case scenario, this may be the end of my run and have to restart with Pisces. That would be really, really bad. I do not want that. But we're going to see. We're going to do everything we can to try and get past this battle. So, hopefully having neutral compat, he's not going to be doing 36 with his Knight Sword. But I'm thinking he's going to be doing something like 48. Before, I was looking online and it said the Platina Dagger had a strength of 7. Or weapon power of 7. Which would have been able to calculate enough. I have Battle Boots? No, I have the Mantle. He has Battle Boots. That makes his move 4. If he had only 3, I think Night Sword has 3. We might have been able to actually him come this way and then run away. That could have been a possibility. To shoot him again. Or run this way or run. Is there any way to weaken the damage sword skills do? So that would be very helpful. Or it could be possible, I didn't look at his speed, but if I just continue to stand in place and double, maybe I can get double turns by waiting. Yeah, he's doing more damage than I am, so that's... I didn't see what the range was, but only I have less moves, so we're not going to be able to outrange his... So yeah, that's a restart already. This is a problem. This is a big problem. I'm worried. I'm really, really hoping that all my efforts won't be in vain. I've already come so far. I don't want to have to end somewhere here just because of bad compat. We'll get over this. So, like I was saying before, using a knife isn't going to increase our damage any because the weapon power is only 5. It would only be doing 30. So, let's see what we can get here in our random battles. This is definitely going well so far. We're getting random battles, isn't it? Wow, what the heck? You can get random battles here, can't you? I thought it was supposed to be like a 50% chance of getting a battle. Alright. There. How many in-game days was that? Probably spent like a whole month trying to get a battle. <laughs> Alright. I might want to put equip change on. I should have put equip change on just so I could have tried the dagger. Just so I could be doubly sure that neither of them worked. But I'm pretty sure I did the math right. So... I was in the GameFAQs topic asking about this, and they were saying the only things I'd probably have to worry about was um, Elmdor and um, that Zodiac at the end of the game, but it looks like this is going to be a problem too now. I have to go and ask on GameFAQs and see what they think I should do, or if I'm just screwed already. I truly hope that's not the case. He doesn't even have high enough level to have power or anything useful. No. That Brigandine? Is that better than... It is. It's better than... The wizard outfit as far as health goes. Um... Didn't have anything else. The chance of him... Treasure boxing though aren't too great, but... I think we're just gonna stay up here. Shoot up people. Hmm. We don't. High ground isn't going to affect anything. So. Alright. This battle is going to be extremely easy. So. Just stay away. Shoot them. I mean, we have auto potion still. So that's not going to matter much for anything. 
neutral combat for all these guys, so it's just single shot. I'm really I'm curious to what I can do about this Zodiac issue. I should have double checked at the beginning, because I thought I had checked and it was like March 15th through April 14th or something like that. But apparently that was Taurus. Or no, apparently it's Aries, because that's what I am, because that's what I picked in between. Get this guy in critical, and then we're going to go for the Archer, because I want to kill him and hopefully... This guy's going to be able to hit me, I was trying to hope to get over up here. No. What's the range of that freaky mind ability? Is it two? Because if it's two, he's going to be able to hit me. This archer's going to hit me. Oh, he went... Okay, he can still hit me there. 60% chance my mantle is living up to its... Oh. Well, it's got quite the range then. And it missed, luckily. That guy's going to run away. I don't think I can out... Maneuver his freaky mind abilities. I can't even get up there. Do I even have the jump? 6, 10? That's 4. I'd have to go that way. Well. Alrighty then. I should have just stayed over on that hill. So much for using my terrain to my advantage. So I want to put this guy in critical. So he'll run away and then we can kill the archer. And hope he treasure boxes and get me, me that brigadine. Do we even care about that? I honestly don't. I'm still so mad about not being able to do damage on Gath. How much would I... Oh. Is that good or bad? Oh, you do more damage, so that's good. I don't know. As long as I don't walk into deep waters for no reason. But what was I saying? Even I get a if I get a power wrist plus the twist headband and the power sleeve, will that be enough to get me damage more than 48? Because that's how much he's doing would either be that or be able to outrun him. Because with him with battle boots, that's like the worst. If anyone want to come in with a battle boots instead of mantle and try to outrun him as opposed to Ooh, wow, was that yeah, it was max damage critical hit. Berserk Ramza going crazy shooting up people. He's gone postal. <laughs> but let's see. Power sleeve is plus two. Twist headband is plus one, and then wrist, power wrist or diamond armlet, either one, will be plus one also. So that's plus four PA total, plus what I already have. So that give me eight PA. So in the equation, let me see what it was. PA plus speed. So that's eight plus eight. 16 divided by 2, which is 8 times weapon power, which is 5. 5 times 8 is 40. So that would not make a difference. Huh. Crap. Actually, I'm just going to stop the video here. I'm probably not going to upload this. And I'm going to go online and ask and wait for responses and see what they say if I'm really screwed or not if I am screwed I'm gonna just put this up and this will be the last video and then whatever QQ game over GG and that'll be the end of my run or something so there's not really anything else I could do so unless I went and break broke the level cap so I can get better equipment and possibly a better knife or something perhaps I could farm a better knife somewhere I don't know. But yeah, that's it for this part. Hopefully it's not the last. So, keep your fingers crossed. We'll see how things go.